how is it going everybody mr android here guys if you are following this channel then you might already know that i love making videos on different android skins and i really care about the software experience that we get on android phones with that said in today's video i have this gorgeous looking flagship device from honor not only does it have great hardware that can easily compete with most flagships these days but it also comes with a truly unique android experience that offers so many interesting features you won't find on many other android skins including samsung's one ui this phone is running the latest magic os 8 based on android 14 and today i'll be showing you why i think this android skin can provide you with one of the best software experience you can get on any smartphone so it's gonna be a really interesting video make sure you watch it till the very end also let's aim for at least 1000 likes on this one over that said drop a like leave a comment and let's get started all right guys first things first if you look at my home screen it looks quite different from what we usually see on other android phones the best part is that not only does it look different but it is also super productive compared to other android home screens what i have done is i have created a lot of smart folders here that contain shortcuts for specific applications right on your home screen now let's say i want to search a video on youtube Instead of opening the app first and then clicking the search button, I can directly open the YouTube search right from my home screen. Similarly, if I have to post anything on Instagram, I just need to click on this plus icon. Like this, I can create as many smart folders I want and it does support most of the applications you have installed on your phone. Now to create a smart folder, you need to press and hold on the app icon and expand it to bring out all the shortcuts onto your home screen. Magic OS also has enlarged folders and unlike other Android skins, it even lets you resize the folders as per your need. So you can make it as small as just having 3 applications or go all the way up to 12 or 15 apps in a single folder. The best part is you can change the shape and size to perfectly match your home screen layout. I don't think any other UI lets you do this level of customizations with the app folders. Then we can also stack widgets on top of each other which helps you save some space and keep your home screen looks clean. Again a feature that is only present on Samsung One UI and you won't find on many phones these days. So I really like the home screen customization features that we get on Magic OS and not only does it look modern but you can also make it as functional as you can. Now just like the edge panels on One UI, we do have the multi-window dock available on this phone. It not only shows your favorite apps and shortcuts which you can access from anywhere on the screen, but it also has an interesting feature called magic portal. Inside the phone settings, if you go into the assistant and enable the option called magic portal, once done, with a simple touch and hold, you can drag the selected content directly to any application inside the smart dock. You can drag images to post them directly on the Instagram or Twitter. You can copy text and save it to your notes. And another thing you can do is, you can drag images to search for any item on Google Chrome. This just works like the circle to search feature which we get on Samsung and Google flagship devices. Now in case if you want to save any web pages or documents, you can simply swipe down with your three fingers like this and it gets saved directly inside the favorite space that can be accessed anytime you want. Talking about gestures, we do get a lot of cool gestures on Magic OS 8. To take a screenshot, you just need to knock twice with the knuckle on the screen or simply show your palm and close it like this. You can flip your wrist down to scroll any pages and to open apps in a split screen or a pop-up window, simply swipe up from the bottom to the top left corner to enter split screen and if you swipe up to the top right corner, it opens that specific app in a pop-up window. Honestly, these are some amazing gestures and shortcuts which can definitely save you a lot of time and once you get used to these gestures, you will find it difficult using other Android skins. Did you know Magic OS has something very similar to the dynamic island which we have on iPhones? It's called Magic Capsule and even though a lot of Chinese brands tried to copy the dynamic island feature, I would say Honor has the best implementation and it actually works really really well. All you need to do is just go into your settings, notifications and status bar. Now go inside Magic Capsule and enable all three options. Now when you play any music or watch videos, even while setting a timer, if you close or minimize the app, it goes directly into the magic capsule. The best part is that it lets you manage multiple activities at the same time and it does feel extremely smooth with some nice animations. 
Now let me show you some more iOS inspired features and what I liked is that they have implemented these features in a really good way. On Magic OS, you get two different AOD styles. You can make it completely dark just like what we have on other Android phones or you can set this iPhone style always on display which basically shows you a dimmer version of your lock screen where you can see the wallpaper as well. Along with that, it also has the standby feature which shows the time and date when your phone is placed in landscape orientation and the screen is off. This phone offers lock screen customization as well. You can change the clock style, customize the color, add more shortcuts to your lock screen and if you want, you can completely change the look with different designs and styles. Finally, if you talk about animations, it feels buttery smooth when compared to some popular Android skin like the One UI. The animations on this phone feels extremely smooth and I haven't noticed any lag or stutter and the entire UI feels really fluid with some beautiful animations and blur effects. Guys overall I think the Magic OS is feature packed and it has some useful interesting features which are difficult to find on many other Android skins. So if you are someone who likes to have a lot of features on their smartphone then you can definitely try out the Magic OS which is available on Honor devices. So that's pretty much it for this video. Let me know which Android skin you want me to try next and I'll make a review on that very soon. If you guys like this video then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I am Mr. Android and I will see you guys in the next one.